Okay, so today we're going to make a Java project where we connect the OLED on the Arduino board to Java. And we're going to use Formata for Java or Formata for J to make that happen. So here I'm just putting some constants in. I'm going to use uh, Maven to look for the libraries I need. If I'm using Windows, I have to put JSSE first, then uh, I'm going to put in Formata for Java, then SLF for J, JCL. If it's Mac OS on an Intel, uh, then I'm going to just put in Formata for J and uh, SLF for J, JCL. All right, so now I'm going to create the objects for the Formata, and I'm going to start and initialize the board. You have to make sure you get the COM port correct. In this case, I'm using the COM port for my Mac. COM4, COM3, or whatever for Windows might be the way to go. Now I'm going to check that the connection happens and I look at the LEDs on my Arduino board to make that happen. And there we go. We got some LEDs that flash just as they should. Excellent. All right. So now we're going to make sure that we can connect to the OLED. Okay. That's the black box or black display that's on the board right there on the middle left. So I'm going to create the I squared C connection inside of Formata for Java and then the OLED object like that, which is connected over I squared C to the Atmel processor that's on the board. Now I'm going to get all that started. And after that, I am going to have to, um, oh yeah, sorry. I forgot to say that uh, I had to specify what size of OLED display, etc., on there, uh, using the constant that's in there. And now I'm going to initialize the OLED. So init method, and then I clear the screen with a sleep right afterwards. So like 500 milliseconds. And I'm going to write one line. I'm going to put a call to display right after that with another pause, another thread sleep. So display method. And then I need to have a pause on here. I'm going to give it about a second like that. Now we're going to run it and we should see one line appear on the OLED. Here we go. And we have line one displayed on the first line of the OLED. Excellent. So let's, um, let's put many lines on here. Okay. So I use the slash N for a new line. I'm going to put line two and then line three. like that and line four. And I'm going to run that. Let's see what happens. I should have four lines displayed. Okay, here we go. One, two, three, four. Excellent. So now let's modify this and erase the whole screen at the very end. So I do the clear method. And then I have another delay right after that and run it. And here we go. One, two, three, four, and gone. There we go. 